In last year's season opener, Ainer pulled off a shocker when it upset traditional small school power Lakeview. The Blue Jackets went on to open the season with a 3-0 mark, a big headline considering the team had not won more than three games for the previous four years. But then the Blue Jackets won just one more game in 2010. Huge, huge moments early. We started out 3-0, and had everybody excited, and then Johnsonville came and beat our eyes out. So, you know, we, you know, obviously we want to get to that point again to maybe play a little better. And uh, went on the road, lost a tough one over at Hilton Head Prep, game we should have won. And uh, then our region's tough, so we got to be healthy and be ready to go when the region starts. Five starters are back on both sides of the ball. Hunter Wyndham played quarterback and then moved to the wing, rushing for 359 yards and five scores. Devontae Kinlaw has spent the summer competing nationally in track and field. He finished in the top five in two events at the state track meet, and his speed translates to the gridiron. Kinlaw had 870 yards and averaged 6.8 yards a carry. The Jackets also bring back experience on the line with DJ Nash and 6'3", 235-pound Drayshawn Wright. Like many small schools, the linemen will play both ways. It's been nine years since Ainer has had a winning season, an attainable goal for the 2011 version of the Blue Jackets. We made a lot of mistakes at the end of games. We had it right there and then kind of slipped out of our hands, but I think this year uh, we're not going to let that happen due to practice and hard work. Man, I'm ready to go, man. Uh, Coach Jay, he had us hopped up spring practice and stuff, man. We're just ready to go, man. Ready for Friday Night Lights to light up.